Raccoons and welcome to the best day of the year, the first day of school. All right, regardless of what you think, you're here and we couldn't be more excited. There are over 150 staff members here to welcome you and make sure this is the best year of your life. We've got a ton of new raccoons, whether there are 388 freshmen or new raccoons joining us from a bunch of different schools across the country. Welcome to our community. Over the last couple of weeks, many of you have already partaken in a lot of cool chances to go to football games and to get involved through link leaders and whatever freshman orientation, whatever it might be. It's time to take charge. It's time to make this the best year of your life. As we think about who we are, we know we're rooted in our values. We're grounded in our purpose and our values. We're committed to our goals and we're accountable to ourselves and each other. We're all working towards graduation day regardless of how far or how close that might be. So that when you wake up on the day after high school, you can say proudly, I'm a raccoon who's going off to a four-year school. I'm a raccoon who's committed to serving in our military. I'm a raccoon who's continuing my learning at WCTC, MATC, or another two-year school. I'm a raccoon heading off in a skilled apprenticeship, ready to make a difference in this world. Or I'm a raccoon who's ready to enter the workforce with the skill set necessary to continue my training in whatever field I identify. We are 1,680 unique individuals coming together under one roof. We've got 176 days this year to make it count. So, let's get started. There are so many new things around campus. So, let me go wake up Rocky. He's been sleeping, and this is a little early for him as well. And let's show you what's happening so that you're familiar with what's new. Rocky, 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 Rocky. Nope. Rocky, nope. Rocky, Rocky, Rocky. Nope. Who are you? I'm Rocky's bouncer. You're just a freshman. Whoa. Okay. Come on, man. One rule, though. You can't fish bump Rocky. I set the rules around there. Rocky, wake up. It's almost the first day of school. There's so much. I know, I know, I know. You've been sleeping. Watch your head, Rocky. Whoa. Okay, here we go. Come on, let's check it out. So exciting! Miss Bump, no, we're back up, no. come on. What did I tell you? A huge shout out to our buildings and grounds team. I know many of you raccoons out there were part of the team this summer cleaning up and getting us ready for the new year. Part of our plan this summer was to continue to upgrade some of our instructional spaces and our bathrooms. If you see a custodian around, thank them. But the best way to thank them is keeping our classrooms and our bathrooms looking neat and clean. In each of our classrooms, we're slowly upgrading each room so that they have a common set of things. New tables, new paint, new TVs, and we're getting there as we go. But the fanciest feature of all is the lighting. Watch this. Rocky's sleeping. The lights go really bright to keep you up. You cannot fist bump Rocky. All right, raccoons, I heard you. You wanted heated lamps, covered everything in the path so that you could stay warm, dry, and everything else like that. I hear you but doesn't mean I'm doing it. Instead, we use the money to invest in some more traffic upgrades, like an added stop sign at the four-way intersection on Stadium Drive in Bolson to make sure that we are all passing through safely and as quickly as possible. Make sure you pay attention to that. Also, we added more speed bumps. That way, when you get really excited to get to school and it's like 718 and you come in off Forest Street and you're going down Stadium Drive and we just lose track of how fast we're going to get to the last parking spot, there'll be speed bumps to slow you down just in case you forgot. Sound good? Perfect. We got new bleachers in the stadium. Some of you experienced that at the football game already last week, but come check them out. Just a quick change. If you're coming to the football games, make sure you enter on the home side rather than the visitor side like you used to do for the student section that was down in the end zone. New bleachers. In the coming weeks, you'll see construction start on a second greenhouse to support our agriculture and FFA program. It's going to be awesome. Come back and check it out. We continue to update our bathrooms around campus, just like our classrooms. So make sure you check them out, treat them with respect, and remember, no cell phones, electronics, or loitering in our restrooms. Again. 
Another thing I want to call your attention to is making an appointment with your counselor. Down here in Student Services with Rocky, if you need to see your counselor or anybody from Student Services, check out these QR codes. They'll bring you to a website where you'll be able to click, see your counselor availability, and make an appointment with them. However, it's important to point out that if you're in immediate need to talk to your counselor or you can't wait until the next available appointment, just come down to Student Services and they will make sure that you can see your counselor as soon as possible. One other quick thing we want to point out is typically we're so used to walking into student services and heading down this hallway to see our counselors. However, we do have Ms. Schaefer and Mr. Eidman are over here um, on that side as well. So pay attention to where you're going. Sound good, Rocky? Step away. Sorry. Now that we're all on the same page around what's new around campus, it's time to dig into the year. Let's go. We always say there's 704 days of the high school experience. And for some of you, this is day one. Welcome freshmen. And for some of you, you're about to embark on your last year. You gotta make each day count. So let's start the 2022-2023 school year in style. Rocky, get to class. All right, now that Rocky's in class and so are you, we are ready to start the new year. A few things to go over before we get things started, right? The transition for all of us, whether we're new, a freshman or a senior, let's all get on the same page. So today's Friday, September 2nd. Thank goodness it's a Friday, we need a three day weekend. All right, how the day is gonna work is we have a modified schedule that's going up on your screen now. We'll start block A at 7.30 after this announcement. Then you'll go through the day almost like normal, a little short in class periods. Block A, block B, block C, you'll get the opportunity to review the community commitments hundreds of times. They'll be good, all on the same page. At the end of block C, you'll stay put, teacher will turn on RCC, and we'll learn about the lunch routines and expectations as we head into the new year. It's always good to remind and refresh ourselves as we start back up. After lunch, you'll head to your Block D, review the community commitments again, and then we'll gather as a community in the Gail Douglas Fieldhouse as we have our back-to-school kickoff assembly hosted by Student Council. Then tonight, we hope to see you at Waukesha South as our football team hopefully takes home a W. Enjoy your three-day weekend. You deserve it. We'll come back on Tuesday, and during Pride each day on Tuesday, that's between Blocks A and B, we'll do several different things to make sure we're set for the new year. So you'll head to your third hour Block B class as normal after Block A, and then we'll turn on RCC, and each day we'll reintroduce ourselves to a norm. So on Tuesday, RCC will go live and have a whole community welcoming event where we'll get to meet some new teachers and hear about what's happening at Oconomowoc High School. Wednesday, Officer Don and I will conduct a safety seminar where we'll review all our safety routines and procedures and our ALICE protocols. Then on Thursday, Ms. Andrews will step in and talk through a little bit about our pride changes and our pride protocols as we get ready to sign up for our first regular pride on Friday, September 9th. Pay attention. There's so much going on. Embrace the moment. Already homecoming is a couple weeks away starting September 18th and going through to the dance on September 24th. It's going to be a great year and let's get it kicked off the right way. All right. What's a snowman's favorite food? Have the best day of your life, raccoons.